So the big question is, what is it exactly that's going on behind that pesky Aquarius poker face that drives everybody nuts, right? Um, the, you know, you know the, the, the scenario rolls around where um, your average person just loses control of their bodily functions and the, uh, the movements of their facial muscles and, and their body language and all of that. And for some strange reason, it seems like Aquarians are the first people to master control of that uh, involuntary reflex. And everybody always speculates, you know? And uh, some people get kind of close, which is pretty cool, fist bump to you guys, but the majority of the people just write it off. Like, oh no, that's not humanly possible to not react to something. It's not humanly possible. So obviously they just have no emotions whatsoever. Uh, well, okay, first of all, the reason that I titled this video and, and making it about uh, the Aquarius poker face is because the, the, the part that drives me the most insane isn't those of you who just don't really get it, okay? I feel for you, right? Uh, but uh, the, the people who drive me the most insane are the people who claim to be able to read energy. I can read your energy so well. Um, I can just, I can read your energy, and right now I can't read any energy from you. Well, um, I got some news for you. If, if you have to go on body language and facial expressions and tone inflections and whatnot, uh, which as you can see, I'm, I'm a pretty animated person when I want to be, and I can react just fine when I want to be, but if that's all you have to go on, uh, you're doing a pretty piss poor job at reading my energy, okay? Me personally, uh, if, if when I go to read somebody's energy, I can close my eyes, I can take one look at you, close my eyes, and get an immediate download of the entire vibration that is your life up to this very moment. Um, and uh, <clears throat> I don't need a facial expression, I don't need body language, I don't need your tone inflection, I don't need uh, how many times you blink. Uh, whether or not your eyebrows go this way, or your eyeballs go this way, or your mouth goes this way, or, or whether or not you sound sad or mad, or it I don't need none of that shit, okay? And um, if, if you do, you might want to, like, reconsider how well you can read energy, okay? Because that is a form of energy, you know, body language. Uh, energy definitely uh, has the capability to come out in bodily expressions and reactions and emotional reactions. But if that's all you have to go on, um, it's kind of like the difference between reading a story and watching a movie. If you don't know how to read, the book isn't going to do you any good. You have to watch the movie. You understand what I'm saying here? Are we making a little bit of sense? So, now back to the biggest question. What exactly is going on behind that Aquarius poker face? Uh, well, I'm going to tell you. The vast majority of the time, it's it's the reason it's done is it's because it's in a study mode. Stupid motorcycle. Anyway, it's it's in study mode, and the best way to study is to leave things as they are. The moment I start interacting with you, um, I'm not really leaving things as they are. The best way to gain information about something is to observe it as it already is. Now, the fact that I am right here in front of you already produces enough of a disturbance into the situation. So, um, if I cut off reaction, if I don't really give you anything to play with, and I leave you as, as much as, as to your natural state as I possibly can for me being here with you, I can learn a lot more about you. Does that make any sense at all? Okay. Um, but also, uh, probably the next biggest thing that, uh, that, that, that I really need to put out there is what somebody else is thinking and feeling is none of your damn business, okay? Uh, I don't really quite understand why so many people take it so personally. Like, they have to know what's going on inside of you. They have to, and if not... Uh, you're being mean. Um, at the end of the day, uh, when it all comes down to it, I probably should have saved that point for last, just because that, you know, but this is not a very scripted video. I just kind of set my camera up right here and I'm kind of spitting it out as it comes. But um, yeah, uh, if all else fails, uh, 
what's going on inside of another person isn't really any of your business. And if there is any trust issues there, um, that's something maybe you should just shy away from. Okay? Um, but the Aquarius poker face is probably, that's probably responsible for the vast majority of the Aquarius misconceptions is the fact that when we like to study, we like to leave things as they are. By interacting with you, that disrupts the, the flow. That disrupts the, uh, what's going on. Uh, as I said, just sitting here in front of you, just being here in front of you disrupts it enough. So if I wanna get as accurate of a picture uh, as I can from every end of the spectrum, the best thing I can do is just leave it how it is and let it play out and watch it without disturbing it. Um, I know that wasn't too complicated of an explanation, but um, I kind of wanted to put that out there just a little bit. And uh, this is for Facebook and YouTube. So Facebookers, for those of you who don't really uh, know who I am, my name's Rich. And one of the things that, uh, that I talk about, about many things, obviously, is, uh, is Aquarius. Uh, it's gaining a, a little bit of popularity on YouTube, and it's growing, and it's rolling. And um, yeah, I'm, I, I kind of... I kind of set out not too long ago to, to, to be a voice for all the other Aquarians who are really, really irritated with being so misunderstood in the astrological community. So uh, somebody has to break that, uh, that cycle in the new age that we're in. So I chose to play that part. And uh, if you want to as well, psh, we all got cameras in our pockets, you know, pick it up and say something. Anyway, uh, that's all I got for this one. I got a lot more videos coming out. I'm gonna try to make it uh, a point to do three today and three tomorrow if i possibly can might go live later anyway i gotta go ahead and get out of here and cut this one short you guys have a good one